Greetings. My name's Dave Langer, and I want to teach the whole world SQL. Yep, you heard me right. I want to teach the entire world. Everybody that wants to learn SQL, I want to teach it to them. This video series, this YouTube tutorial series, is a transcription of a blog series that I've been doing on my website, DaveOnData.com, regarding teaching Excel users, which is basically almost everybody, how to learn SQL using their Excel knowledge. This turns out to be both fun and easy. It's a great way to learn SQL by taking something that almost everybody knows, working with Excel tables and Excel pivot tables and some Excel functions, and then translating that into over SQL. And you'll be surprised at how many things that you do in Excel translate directly into SQL. It's, it's pretty amazing. Now, this blog series that I've been writing is about 20 posts right now at the time of this recording, and I'm not quite sure how many more I've got. So there's going to be a lot of content. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to translate all those blog posts into a series of YouTube tutorials. They should be around 30 minutes each or so. And I'll probably put out two, maybe three a week until the blog series is basically done. Um, so there's going to be, you know, for the next at least five weeks or so, maybe even longer than that, on this YouTube channel, there's going to be new video content being posted for this, this tutorial series. Now, the reason for this is pretty simple. Uh, a lot of folks on LinkedIn reached out to me and said, hey, Dave, I love your blog series, but I really would like to have a video tutorial. I prefer a video tutorial to reading a blog post. Totally cool. I'm happy to oblige. So that's the, the genesis of this. Now, if you're deciding to follow along, you'll note that also there are two accompanying videos on my YouTube channel. They're all in the playlist here. And what they do is that shows you, those videos show you how to get set up how to set up either on your laptop, if you'd like, or alternatively using Microsoft's Azure Cloud. In either case, what I'm showing you is completely free. It won't cost you any money to do this tutorial series. You can do it on either on your laptop or on your cloud, on the Azure Cloud. Now, the thing that I should mention is that I use Microsoft's SQL Server as the database platform, and in particular, Microsoft's variant of SQL, which is known as T-SQL. Now, even if you're not using Microsoft SQL Server at your current job, it doesn't really matter because SQL is a highly portable language, highly portable. Uh, if you learn T-SQL, it's very easy to learn PL-SQL, which is Oracle's variant, or to use SQL on the MySQL or PostgreSQL open source databases. Now, if you're a little bit nervous about, oh my goodness, it's Microsoft, Microsoft SQL Server, the last time I checked, was the third most popular database in the world. So it is commonly used in companies of all kinds and sizes. Also, as I mentioned, SQL is highly portable. The concepts go, the, con they, the, port the concepts are easily transferable to any type of database engine that you can think of. Not only that, they're also highly transferable to big data platforms. So for example, if you're familiar with terms like Spark, the Spark platform, or Hive on the Hadoop platform, both of those use SQL variants. So learning T-SQL is very, very useful. Very useful. It's highly portable, it's highly transferable. Not only that, it is a very commonly listed skill on analytics job descriptions. SQL is a great thing for you to have in your tool belt. And if you have Excel knowledge, you can learn SQL. Trust me on this, it's, it's a lot easier than you think. Now, these tutorial videos will follow the same basic format as the blog posts on their website. They'll essentially introduce some sort of concept using Excel as the frame of reference, and then show how those concepts map to the SQL world. So for example, the base concept in Excel is a table. Well, in a database, the base concept is a table as well. Shocker, right? So there you go, right? There's already a conceptual alignment. So we will use a sample database from Microsoft called AdventureWorks to go ahead and write queries and understand queries. I'll take data out of that database, put it in Excel, set the frame of reference for the, for the video, and then show you how those Excel concepts then map over to SQL. Now, a few videos will be SQL only because there are certain things that you end up doing in SQL that, quite frankly, you wouldn't normally do with out-of-the-box Excel. You might with Power Query or DAX or something like that, but not everybody uses those. So because of that, I'm not really going to cover that. I'm just going to say, look, this is a SQL-only post. It's self-contained. I'm assuming a SQL-only video. It's self-contained. 
and you'll watch it. And trust me, it'll be dead simple. I've gotten lots of positive feedback on the blog series on my website. So I am assuming the, these video tutorials will be just as useful for folks as well. Okay, so at any point during the series, if you're interested in learning more, just go ahead and click up here and that'll take you to my website. And you can find out more information or you can go to the blog series if you want more information. It just basically takes you to davondata.com and you can find all the things there. So I'm just super excited about this. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you find it extremely useful. And until next time, I wish you very happy data sleuthing.